comment. I w when I said that, I was talking specifically to people who like to go around and brag to other people that they do work and that if you don't work, you ain't You're shit. Problem, right. See, and that and that's my problem because if they close your job tomorrow, guess what? You ain't worth a motherfucking thing. So if you sitting there, shit, I got a job. I make such and such and such. If you go to work tomorrow and that job closed, guess what? You ain't worth a motherfucking thing. Because other than that, other than that job, you ain't worth nothing. By your words, because you said that. Because the only thing you worth is your job. So if they close your job, that's a wrap for you. That's a wrap for you. You ain't worth nothing <laughs> until you find another one. Because your only value is your job. So what are you really worth? Like, what are you worth? Yourself. If your job fire you, are you worth anything? That's that's my thing. So it's not it's not really about saying that it's bad for somebody to work. It's about it's about the psychology behind what the job means to you and who you are because of the job. You got you understand? Make the money work for you, don't work for the money. That's what that concept means. So, you know, I really I don't know how you got, you know, how you got that I was saying, you know, you said I feel bad for y'all. Justifying being uh, poor. Uh, who is poor? First just, of all, first, just, no, no, no. Just poor? listen. Justifying, justifying, depending on poor. money, is sad. That's that's what's crazy. The fact that you are looking up to something that your ancestors died over. Do you know they put? Listen. Do you know they put guns to your ancestors' head and blew their brains out? In order to force them to get the pieces of paper that you sitting here trying to tell me a real black man, I'm a real one. See, you might be white. Maybe you Caucasoid. So if you Caucasoid, then I'm not talking to you because you don't relate to me. You don't You don't have my genetics. You don't have my history. You're not one of me. You're not in front of this planet. To keep it 100, but we ain't going to go into that. But if you want to me, then you are just lost. If you believe that you're supposed to wake up and work every day to get something that grows from the planet, are you fucking kidding me? Are you kidding me? So you but listen. So Ed, let me ask you this. You believe that you're supposed to work for food, right? How come you ain't supposed to work for air? Answer. I'll wait. I'll wait. I'll wait. So, so why, why don't you have to work for air? Because you need food to live. You'll die without food, right? But they make you work for it. So why don't you have to work for air? And if you believe you're supposed to work for air, then you need to hold your breath until you go get a job. And if your job fire you, you dead if you don't get a job in eight minutes because that's how long you need air. So explain to me why you get to breathe and not work for it.